The American Civil Liberties Union has filed a lawsuit against the FBI, the CIA, and other intelligence agencies demanding records about the detention in the United Arab Emirates of a U.S. citizen who claims that the U.S. government colluded in his arrest and torture. Naji Hamdan, a naturalized American of Lebanese origin, was arrested in the UAE in 2008 and eventually convicted of terrorism charges and sentenced to 18 months in prison by a court in Abu Dhabi. He was released almost immediately because of time served in pretrial detention. He was then deported to Lebanon, where he now lives with his family. Hamdan, who previously owned an auto parts store in Los Angeles, California, and managed an Islamic center, says that he confessed under torture at a secret prison in the UAE and that the U.S. government orchestrated his arrest and interrogation. In one interrogation session, he says he heard a voice that sounded American, warning him to, quote, do what they want or these people will expletive you up. The ACLU says the suit was filed after various federal agencies failed to release any information about Hamdan under a Freedom of Information Act request filed in January. As far back as 1999, Hamdan had been questioned frequently by the FBI in the United States. He was never charged with any crime. The ACLU's Jenny Pascarella said, quote, This suit seeks to shed light on the U.S. government's practice of contracting with foreign governments to detain, interrogate, and often torture individual it suspects, rightly or wrongly, of having connections to terrorism because the U.S. cannot lawfully engage in these tactics itself.